A war of words between Iowa's largest paper and South Dakota Governor Dennis Dugard involving some disparaging remarks the paper printed in its editorial page. We first told you about the clash earlier this week. KSFY's Brian Allen was in Pierre today and spoke with the governor about what the paper said and how the governor replied in this KSFY follow-up. The Des Moines Register article chastised efforts by Republicans in the Iowa Senate to reform the state's tax structure by eliminating both corporate income tax and individual income tax, similar to what South Dakota already has in place. The Register article called South Dakota the wall drug state and said that if Iowa's tax structure was similar to South Dakota's, it would mean years of budget shortfalls and, in short, not a very good stable economy. Well, that didn't sit well with Governor Dugard, and he fired back in a letter to the editor, and the governor didn't pull any punches. The Des Moines Register was just looking for some ways to get attention, probably. There really is no need to involve South Dakota unless they wanted to compare themselves to a more favorable state. I think our finances have been well run in South Dakota. Certainly our credit rating agencies think so, uh, giving us AAA rating, and I think not having an income tax is a good thing, and most people agree with that. The governor was very clear that he didn't understand why the Des Moines Register was using an opinion piece about an Iowa issue to attack the state of South Dakota. Reporting from the state capitol in Pierre, Brian Allen, KSFY News. And in his written response, the governor also reminded the Register that South Dakota is the Mount Rushmore state and added that while drug is a strong family-owned business.